peace and love, peace and love. In the annals of ancient Egyptian history, two female pharaohs stand out for their remarkable leadership and the indelible marks they left on their civilization, Queen Kentkaus I and Pharaoh Hatshepsut. Kentkaus was the enigmatic queen at the twilight of the fourth dynasty and dawn of the fifth, Queen Kentkaus I emerges as a pivotal figure. Her unique titulary, Emuti Ensu by TJNSW by Chi, has intrigued historians, offering two possible translations. The first, mother of two kings of Upper and Lower Egypt, acknowledges her as the mother of two monarchs. The second, more intriguing possibility suggests she might have been both mother of the king of Upper and Lower Egypt and king of Upper and Lower Egypt. This interpretation has sparked speculation about her potential role as a ruler, potentially the mysterious Thamthis, who Manetho cites as the last king of the fourth dynasty. If true, Kentkaus I would be the earliest queen known to have assumed the title of king of Upper and Lower Egypt, a monumental achievement in the annals of ancient history. Hatshepsut, the woman who became king. Centuries later, Hatshepsut ascended as the great royal wife of Pharaoh Thutmose II. Upon his death, she initially ruled as regent for the young Thutmose III, but soon took the unprecedented step of declaring herself pharaoh, becoming the fifth ruler of the 18th dynasty around 1479 BC. Her reign lasting until about 1458 BC marked her as Egypt's second confirmed female monarch, following Sobeneferu of the 12th dynasty. Hatshepsut's reign was a golden era, characterized by prosperity, peace, and artistic flourishing. She commissioned numerous building projects, including her magnificent mortuary temple at Deir el-Bari. Moreover, she sponsored one of Egypt's most successful trading expeditions to the mysterious land of Pont, likely modern-day Eritrea. This venture brought back invaluable resources like gold, ebony and incense, enriching Egypt's coffers and enhancing its global stature. Both Kent Kauswan and Hatshepsut demonstrated extraordinary acumen in navigating the complex political landscapes of their times. They defied traditional gender roles, with Hatshepsut even donning the pharaoh's traditional false beard, symbolizing her absolute authority. Their reigns underscore the remarkable adaptability and resilience of female leadership in a predominantly male-dominated arena. Their stories inspire a deep appreciation of our past, reminding us that history is replete with examples of women who not only held power but wielded it with a wisdom and effectiveness that rivaled and often surpassed their male counterparts. In studying these figures, we gain not only knowledge of history, but also a profound understanding of the potential for leadership and greatness, regardless of gender, a lesson as relevant today as it was in ancient Egypt. Their legacies, etched in stone and preserved through millennia, serve as powerful testaments to their foresight and governance. Kent Kaus I and Hatshepsut were not mere footnotes in the saga of pharaohs. They were architects of their own stories, shapers of history. Kent Kaus I, the mother of kings, Kent Kaus I's role, potentially straddling the role of queen and pharaoh, illustrates a unique moment in Egyptian history where a woman's influence transcended conventional boundaries. Her possible assumption of kingship, a role traditionally reserved for men, indicates a period of potential political upheaval and dynastic transition. Her ability to maintain stability and continuity during such a transformative era speaks volumes about her leadership and acumen. Hatshepsut, the pharaoh who reinvented herself, Hatshepsut's reign stands as a high watermark of ancient Egyptian civilization. Her extensive building projects not only demonstrated her power, but also her dedication to the gods, reinforcing her legitimacy as pharaoh. By adopting the full regalia and titles of a king, Hatshepsut challenged and redefined the expectations of her role, asserting her authority in an unprecedented manner. Her successful trade expedition to Punt not only enriched Egypt, but also highlighted her diplomatic prowess and strategic vision. Under her rule, Egypt enjoyed a period of peace and prosperity, allowing arts and architecture to flourish. Her reign, characterized by economic success and cultural renaissance, is often cited as one of the most successful in Egypt's history. Legacy of inspiration, the stories of Kent Kauswa and Hatshepsut are more than historical curiosities. They are narratives of empowerment and innovation. They broke barriers, redefined their roles, and led their nation through periods of significant change. 
These women ruling in an era dominated by men showed that leadership and vision are not constrained by gender. In reflecting on their legacies, we find a source of inspiration. Their lives remind us that history is not just a series of events, but a tapestry woven by individuals who dared to imagine a different world. Kent Kauswai and Hatshepsut, in their own unique ways, expanded the horizons of what was possible in their time. They challenge us to look beyond the conventional, to lead with courage and vision, and to carve our paths in the pursuit of greatness. As we delve into the annals of the past, we find not only knowledge of bygone eras, but also lessons in resilience, ingenuity, and the enduring power of human spirit. The stories of these remarkable women, echoing through the ages, encourage us to approach our challenges with the same boldness and to leave our mark for generations to come. The enduring influence of Kent Kauswan and Hatshepsut as we delve deeper into the lives of Kent Kaus I and Hatshepsut, their enduring influence becomes even more apparent, transcending the boundaries of their time and offering timeless lessons in leadership and innovation. Kent Kaus was a symbol of dynastic resilience, the enigmatic queen Kent Kaus Thirst, often overshadowed by the grandeur of pharaohs, represents a crucial link between dynasties. Her potential dual role as a mother of kings and a ruler herself highlights the flexibility and resilience of the Egyptian dynastic system during times of potential crisis. She exemplifies the ability to adapt to changing circumstances, maintaining stability and continuity in a period of transition. Her story is a powerful reminder of the often unseen forces that shape history and the critical role women have played in it. Hatshepsut, the architect of prosperity, Hatshepsut's reign was not just a period of peace and prosperity, but also an era of cultural and architectural renaissance. Her construction projects, including the magnificent temple at Deir el-Bari, stand as enduring symbols of her reign and the pinnacle of ancient Egyptian architecture. These structures are not mere monuments of stone, they are testaments to a ruler's vision and determination to leave a lasting legacy. Her deft handling of power dynamics using both religious and traditional symbolism to legitimize her reign showcases her political acumen and understanding of the cultural context in which she operated. Hatshepsut was not just a ruler, she was a visionary who reshaped her role to meet the needs of her time. Echoes in modern leadership, the stories of Kent Kaus I and Hatshepsut resonate in modern leadership narratives. They were pioneers in their own right, navigating and reshaping the landscapes of power in a world dominated by men. Their reigns demonstrate that effective leadership is not about conforming to established norms, but about redefining possibilities and leading with conviction. In today's world where leadership roles are increasingly diverse and complex, the tales of these ancient Egyptian rulers remind us of the importance of adaptability, vision and resilience. They exemplify that true leadership is about creating a lasting impact, building a legacy that stands the test of time. A legacy of empowerment. As we reflect on the past, Kent Kaus Wurst and Hatshepsut stand as beacons of empowerment. They challenge us to rethink our perceptions of history and leadership. Their lives encourage us to recognize and value the contributions of women in history, often overlooked or understated. Their legacy is not just in the monuments they built or the wealth they amassed, but in the paths they forged. They remind us that our actions today can shape the narratives of tomorrow, inspiring future generations to pursue their visions with courage and determination. The stories of Kent Kaus I and Hatshepsut are not just tales of ancient rulers, they are enduring narratives of human potential and the power of bold leadership. Click like, subscribe and share this channel.